Thanks very much for taking the time to look at Farm Matters software. It's very, very simple. It's a Windows based program. So you have an opening home screen where you have different tiles of information. These can be altered by clicking on the little option icon here. Then the available tiles on the left hand side can be dragged across to the right hand side and subsequently the ones on the right hand side can be dragged across to the left hand side and then you can click OK and this will change the layout as you can see there are many different options available these tile layouts offer you many different snapshots of your data obviously probably the most important ones are if you're in England the cattle tracing system BCMS and if you're in Scotland obviously the Scott moves looking at the way this program's laid out the main sections are across the top so home cattle sheep fields NVZ medical products contacts and EID and then subsequently below you have your subsections which you can just click on the main principle throughout the program is if I use on farm and events in cattle to illustrate is that your records are listed nice and clearly this can be your cattle your fields your treatments whatever it may be they're listed very nice and clearly now how you manipulate and change this screen is very important for you to know because it's very flexible if I right click with the mouse you'll see that you have all your hidden options available to you now whatever you highlight in the first place and then you choose the event afterwards will be affected by the event so for argument's sake we've chosen to highlight animal ending 1871 so if I go to right click events I can then choose the event associated with this animal and as you can see there are many to choose from also at the bottom of the right click you'll see grid setup now every screen works in exactly the same way so if you click on grid setup you'll be offered a vast amount of possible columns that you can actually switch on and off so if I just type in up here for instance notes you'll see that animal notes appears and then you can tick that and click OK and as you can see animal notes appears to the right hand side now you'll see me moving something there now this is called grid overlay you can actually choose to color the grid based on some criteria for instance animals under medication approaching 30 months due to calf and various different alerts or basically flagging events so that this will colorize the information available to you so it gives you a quick reminder a quick snapshot these can be changed as well by clicking on the little colored box to the left hand side so for instance due to calf you'll see that you can have a primary highlight a secondary highlight and you can stipulate the date range in between so to record an event quite simply cattle at the top on farm events right click events and choose the event the grid as well as that can be moved up and altered by picking up the columns and holding it down and dragging and dropping it can be sorted up and down like so you can find animals by typing in amount of ear tag and just backspace you can highlight more than one by clicking and dragging or holding the control key down like so and you can batch by going to batches and add to batch or in this case the shortcut key F4 which then populates the batch listing below you can then save those batches as you'll see on the icons right hand side give those a name okay that batch is now been saved and there's the name test one and then at the top of the screen you'll see the icon there open batch where you have a million different options to put in many different batches management groups or management pens even to micromanage the groups of animals on your farm 
if you just double click on the batch it'll bring it up below or if you want to go back into batches you can actually right click on the batch and perform the event from there so as you can see farm matters is a very flexible system and offers a wealth of record keeping and management within one easy to use package most importantly please get in touch it's what we do and i'm delighted delighted to help at any time there is much much more to this so please check out our other videos but as i say please don't hesitate to get in touch there's no obligation and i'm sure we'd love to help thanks very much now if you found this video helpful please drop a like and click the subscribe button below.